Hello everyone, welcome back to the channel. In this video, we will be taking a look at Eleven Labs versus Speechify. Now, which is better? So when it comes to text-to-speech technology, there are two software that we can think of. So this is Eleven Labs and also Speechify. Now, both do offer high quality, natural sounding voices to convert written content into audio experience. So let's go ahead and take a look at both of them. So when it comes to pioneering in voice cloning, Eleven Labs has allowed users to create realistic replicas of existing voices and allows us to have diverse voice content, which also allows us to change expressive voices. And Speechify is renowned for its user-friendly interface and vast voice library. So Speechify excels in crafting an immersive audiobook experience. Now, when it comes to voice options, Speechify boasts a wider selection with over 200 voices, while Eleven Labs only offers around 100 voices, but some include or are designed for specific emotions. And when it comes to voice cloning, Eleven Labs outshines Speechify with its advanced voice cloning capabilities, which usually requires around 30 minutes to 3 hours, delivering more accurate recreations. But over time, Speechify also has these options. Now, so both text-to-speech service also allows for basic editing tools, such as control over pace and intonation and emotion of each voice. Now let's go ahead and take a look at the website for both service. So when we take a look at 11 labs, this is usually what we would see at the beginning, where we can go ahead and generate speech synthesis. So this can be taken from text to speech, or even using speech to speech by uploading a voice of your choice. You can go ahead and select the different models that you want. And as you can see, the latest version allows for more languages, up to 29 languages in total. You can also go ahead and choose the different pre-made voices right here. And allow for more granular control on the currently selected speech. Now all you need to do is to go ahead and add in your text and generate for speech synthesis. Now Eleven Labs also has the ability to create voices. So this means that you can go ahead and clone your own voice or you can go ahead and generate a new voice that you want. There are a vast amount of voices that you can sample or add to your voice lab. There is also this project section, which is for long form content, such as for documentation, as well as audiobook experiences. And finally, Eleven Labs also allows for dubbing, where you can go ahead and add a translation of different languages, up to 29 languages in total, on the kind of content that you want. So if you want to go ahead and add dubbing to your social media or any form of film or TV show, marketing and e-learning and education, you can go ahead and generate them right here. Now, if we head on over into Speechify, when it comes to the products that Speechify offers, there are multiple things that you can go ahead and do. So you can go ahead and use Speechify for text-to-speech, which is usually when it comes to reading or adding audio to books and also you can go ahead and add all of these different extensions that you want there is also a section on the ai voice studio which allows you to go ahead and add voiceovers which allows you to go ahead and convert your content into speech so this is text to speech you can go ahead and add voice cloning AI dubbing, transcription, and also usage of an AI avatar. If we go ahead and go to the actual Speechify itself, then we should be able to go ahead and generate text-to-speech 
on all of the different documents that you want. But if you go ahead over into the Speechify Studio, this allows us to utilize the power of speech synthesis and AI for different projects. So such projects that Speechify allows you to do are voiceovers, dubbing, and AI avatar. So when it comes to voiceover itself, then, then this is what the editor would look like, where you can go ahead and make changes to the actual script itself. So you are able to go ahead and edit your content. So you're not just generating the speech, but you're also able to go ahead and adjust them into a content itself. Now, if you want a tutorial on how we can go ahead and generate content with Speechify, then don't forget to go ahead and comment down below, or we will go ahead and generate this for future videos. Now for Speechify, we can go ahead and select the different available voices that we want, or we can go ahead and generate our own voice as well where we can go ahead and clone our voice. And as you can see, this is still a beta version. This is still not as comprehensive as 11 Labs. But when it comes to Speechify, you are able to go ahead and add an avatar into your content itself. So if you want to go ahead and generate some form of sales training content or using the avatar so content, then you can go ahead and use any of these. Similarly to 11 labs, there is also the ability to go ahead and use some form of dubbing. So if we give some example right here, in a large volume, so you'll have it for eight servers. And then we right. change translation. Farò soffriggere l'aglio e lo scalogno in un po' d'olio. Questo ridurrà di molto il tempo. As you can see, it has automatically translated it and also dubbed the audio itself. So when it comes to voice cloning or adding expressive voices, then 11 Labs is the ideal text-to-speech service for you. Or if you want to utilize text-to-speech service, but also focus on generating content, then Speechify is something for you to take a look at. Now, both platforms offer free trials, allowing you to test drive their features and voices before committing. And your specific needs and preferences ultimately determine which platform best serves you. Well, that's it for today's video. I hope that this has helped you explore both software. Don't forget to hit that like and subscribe and see you guys next time.